1310. Yes, mate, yes. So, a vital stage in the, well, you know, if you win tonight, say, well, I'm not going to say a score. Well, say five nil. Nil. <laughs> exactly. Then uh, that'll be <laughs> it. Four stars to your name. Yeah. So, <laughs> every frame, as always, is important. It's important, yeah. And um, let's just say we both play well, eh? Yeah, play well, mate. Cheers. Hi guys, welcome to frame 23, series 6, Snooker's Burden Trophy. This is a new session that we played last night and we got five frames in and they were long frames and this one was actually about 45 minutes long. We've <laughs> I've edited it down to 22. So sit back, relax and enjoy some amateur snooker. Current scores are 13 frames to 10 to Mr. Harris. So I myself am trying my hardest to get back into this frame, possibly closing that gap as much as possible. Our first frame of every session is always a little bit cagey. That was a, a not very good safety shot and that's a bang in red from Mark and he's got a lovely position on the black. Next red's gonna be tricky. Can he get onto this one? Well, not quite there. So safety it is, but a good start from Mark. Some nice pots on the red. Lovely position on that black. If you're enjoying the series guys, don't forget to give us a subscribe. And again, that was a nice red. Shame I hit the black then, if it just passed the left hand side of it, it would have been on the black pack, nicely. Just into the pack. Yeah. Trying to get the cue ball behind the green to snook a mark. Didn't quite work out. Has this white got enough legs? Am I going to be tempted? Mm, that red did go, the top red to the left of the pink. But. It was a risky shot early on in this frame. And anyway, I've set Mark up anyway, so maybe I should have gone for that one. So, yeah, Mark's potting well. Always, always starts off quite strong. Well, this would be a nice little break if we can keep this, keep this going. Ah, oh, that's a shame, is it a bit too short there? It's cuttable, but it's going to be a mad cut. Ooh, rattled in the jaw, that might cause a few problems. Seeing as nothing else really goes at the moment, it's going to be some safety play, and uh, I'm going to try and get the cue ball up behind the green, and look at this, my trademark in off. Well, that's one so far in this frame. Um, seeing as everything's quite safe, Mark's asked me to play that shot again. Oh dear, did I nearly do it again. Again, this say it's gonna be a few safety shots until we can get one of us can pot this black. Well, it's the same shot again, but I need to be careful of the in off again. Oh dear, not again, surely. Well, there's two. Yeah, wise choice. I've left it quite awkward for Mark, although there is a pot in chance here. And it's, oh, it, was, it wasn't, it wasn't far off. Little shout out to our sponsors, Kahuna Flooring. Thanks for the support so far, guys. If you pop that fucking green coming down there, you've got to get that bang on every Yeah, time. so all the reds are slowly working their way over towards the black. One of us needs to do something magical. Not sure what yet. And I made sure this time that that white ball was going nowhere near the pocket. Wow. 
What's Mark spotted here? Is, is there a plant? Does the red pass the black? Oh, do want to come over? oh dear. Well, there's a mistake there from Mark. And I should be able to get this red and the black. Play that just soft enough. I'm trying to play now for the red, uh, literally in the middle of the white and black. And I, oh, I didn't come far enough. Or maybe I, should, yeah, because it wouldn't have gone in the bottom right pocket. Anyway, I've spotted a red to the middle pocket. And unfortunately, I didn't quite get on the black there. So confidence is high. I'm going to take on this yellow and left myself with a shot to nothing the red to the left of the black might be able to pot this or if i'm miles off like that i need a bit of a kiss here well overhit that and i've left mark a chance unfortunately for mark was not on target anyway Nothing really left on for me. I don't know about this red to the left pocket near the bottom left pocket. That might have been potable. Anyway, I tried to get the white behind the green without going in off. Yeah, that red I was talking about. Maybe that one should have, could have been potable. So another safety. If I can avoid any double kisses, get the white safe. I've left Mark a little bit of a shot to nothing here. The red near the pink, the left bottom one. Yeah, that's a banging shot, banging pot. And well, it has to be. Yellow gives a nice angle, green. Maybe that should have been yellow. Now, I've spotted a little bit of a plant. There's a bit of work to do and I was miles off. But what I've cut out of this frame is me eyeing it up, lining it up. Um, because the frame is so long, I've had to cut a lot of the walking around the table out and lining up shots and all that, I'm trying to just cut it down to each player taking their shot. Anyway, if I can get this in, the black's sitting there and I... I mean, you could see my arm, my, threw my arm out there. I must have queued right across that. And Mark's, unfortunately, missed the same red. Now, this red nearest, nearest me from those two does pass, but it has to be just right, and it wasn't. Cool, now I've left a red over the pocket, which I've managed to cover. If Mark can pop this red into the middle, then we could be, oh, I was going to say, we could be seeing a bit of a nice break here. Well, what I've cut out is the red nearest my hand on the bottom cushion really is the red to go for if I want to get a decent break. But I just didn't fancy it. I didn't fancy it. Maybe I bottled it. But I thought, well, if I can get the cue ball out here, I've come too far. Um... So I've taken the middle pocket red to play for the blue with a nice, with my, left myself a bit of an angle to get back amongst the reds, but there isn't any really red here that's easy to go for. So I try to get onto the bottom cushion and giving it some power, I, I've, I've missed a shot completely. Anyway, it's Mark's turn now. This is the red I refused earlier. Well, pace kept it out. But it's a nice white anyway. Let's see if I can get a nice white as well. Well, oh, so lucky not to get a double kiss there. I think Mark's going to try and get me behind the blue. It's a good shot. Just died a little bit off that cushion. So there's a chance I can pop this red into the middle. And guess what, everybody? You'll never believe what happens next. Da, da, da. Well, that's three in this frame so far. That's 12 points given away. Unbelievable. Just given away. 
Anyway, there all the reds are a little bit tied up, so I did try and pot that in this middle pocket. That was the only red I thought, well, I can't see what else to do here. Mark's gone for a cheeky double. Wasn't far off. I'm going to try and get the cue ball back towards the black. And uh, no, I haven't quite hit that right. Mark's going to do, I think, yeah, same shot. And that's much better than my attempt. So now all the reds are working their way up towards the bulk end. Um, safety shot here, quite a risky one. Didn't want the double kiss. Left Mark a red to pop in the middle pocket now. Cue ball was supposed to be up near the blue. And uh, that little kiss on the pinks just made this next shot a little bit more difficult. And having been difficult, it's he's now Mark's missed it. So I've now got a red to the left middle and I want to avoid the pink. <laughs> if I tried to hit the pink, I probably would have missed it. Maybe I should do that next time. Anyway, blue's on. Need to do a nice controlled pot here. So I was playing for the red nearest the yellow spot and I didn't quite come down far enough, but it's still potable. And I've not come far enough for the blue, but it does go obviously in this bottom left pocket, which is what I'm gonna have to do. Yeah, it's nice and controlled, but obviously next red is going to be tricky. But confidence, like I said, is high at the minute, so I'm just going for it. Anyway, that was a miss, and I've potentially left Mark a lovely opportunity. If he can pop this red, it should be able to stay on the pink or black. Well... It's pretty safe anyway. I can just about see enough of this red I'm going for to possibly pot it. Well, I don't think it was enough and given Mark a couple of options now. If he can pot this, get back in the lead perhaps. Oh, it's caught the jaws. And it's, it's all safe. All the reds are pretty safe, so I needed to get this one safe as well without leaving it on. Well, that was a bit of a fortunate double kiss. Again, Mark's going for a double into the middle pocket. Second attempt. Whoa. Hit the same, I think it, the first attempt hit the same part of the jaw. Anyway. I'm hampered over the black, so safety shot it is. I was thinking about going for the pot, but no, not at this moment in the frame. Nothing risky, no heroics, really. This could be a triple. Well, I'll talk you through this next shot on the way home. He's only been an Done it again. Can you believe it? That's four in offs in this one frame. And that was a disaster. Now, I thought Mark was gonna go for this red nearest the cue ball, but um, decided to take the middle pocket one. Uh, maybe should have gone for that red, but he's left me a chance now. Ah, oh dear. And the scores are tied at 33 each. Not for long. Where is this cue ball going? Is it Mark's turn to go in off? Oosh. Not with a nut shove. And he's going for the black. That's going to be some nice points. If this goes in, no. Wow. I can obviously see the red on the right cushion. 
and I can just about see this red near the black, which I want to try and put safe as well. And it's not potable in this left pocket because it won't pass the pink, so not a bad shot there. And Mark's not quite got the legs on this, and he's left me a chance. I should be able to play up for the black. Avoids the brown, and it's unfortunately about two millimeters away from the black. And I just wanted to play a little snooker there, which I've got. I mean, unfortunately, I've given Mark a nice sort of angle there, and that's a good escape. I could have played a better shot, maybe I should have played into the yellow, and I don't know. Anyway. My attempt at getting some points back didn't quite work. Where's it going? Oh, keep running. This needs to keep going, otherwise it's going to be potable. Well, scores are tied again. And that's a lucky kiss on the yellow. Can I get a safety out of this? I'll be afraid that not very much shot for you. Yes, I can. That's a nice little shot. Has Mark got me in a snooker? It looks like I can just about see enough of the red not to pot it, but just to clip the paintwork. At least this cue board has slowed down. Oh dear, well, the kiss helped on the pink, but um, I think Mark France is this one. Yeah, that's a nice pot, but he didn't check if the black passed the yellow and it does not. And Mark a little bit peeved about that one. And that was a nice red to be honest, but unfortunately didn't get on the black. Well, normally I would take this yellow on to pot, but I thought I'd be a bit more cautious, this frame. And I played a safety. Can Mark do the same shot? Is he going to go for a pot here? And a nice safety. Nice yeah. cue ball and yellow. I mean, that's perfect, really. But is there a chance I can get the cue ball behind the pink? I can't. I don't think I'll be able to because I couldn't dig into the white there. And I've, luckily that little kiss on the black has put the yellow safe. What's Mark going to do here? Send it around the table. Oh, he's just clipped the paintwork. That's a nice little shot. When I try that, I usually miss the ball completely. Well, what am I going to do now? Send the yellow back towards the pink is the plan, I think. Oh dear. Didn't quite get into it. And a double kiss has left Mark. Not an easy shot, but with the rest, he's normally quite good with that. And yeah, he's part of the yellow, but green's gonna be have, gonna have to be a safety shot. Just enough to go past the middle pocket. Well, there's only three points in it, so all the colours are very important, and that is, uh, it would have been a good shot had it had I not hit it so hard. So, can Mark pop this and stay on the brown? No. And it's just rolled close enough to the cushion that it's very difficult to pop. But I thought I'd try and play a safety, but try and pot it as well. And this is one of them shots, isn't it? Do you come off the bottom cushion? No. Well, this green's being a bit stubborn. Trouble is, getting onto the brown's difficult, so... I think I went for this. I did. Anyway, it's... Pretty safe. Or anywhere we go, really. 
And has Mark got the snooker here? Yes, he has. Now, I didn't even walk around the table and have a proper look at this. I just got down and hit it. And I've missed. Not by much, I must say. That's another four points. I've lost count now. That's 20 points, I think, given away. Oh, Mark nearly joined my club then. Yin offs. Well, you know, if I hadn't given away 20 points, then I'd have a quite a comfortable lead right now. Well, you know, sometimes <laughs> all the in offs this frame, I deserve a little bit of luck. Now, trying to just clip the paintwork, and I've hit the brown quite thick. Nearly got a snooker behind the, the black there, but um, it's going to have to be a safety shot from Mark. Can he get a snooker? He's gone for it. Is the brown going to run past the blue? No, it's just left a gap big enough for me to get through. And this is, I've overhit that somewhat. Oh, the brown's off the cushion slightly, so I can't imagine Mark could be going for the pot. Wow, well, that's a banger, ladies and gentlemen. Fair play. Yeah, well, just the blue for Mark. Well, no, blue and pink, actually. Otherwise, I could draw. And that was my chance to take the frame. And I blew it. Can Mark hold his nerve? Yes, he can. It's a nice blue and... Well, I don't think he's going to miss this, do you? So, that's got to be framed to Mark. Yeah, fair play. Well, that makes the scores 14-10 to Mr. Harris. Um, thanks for watching, guys. And we'll see you in the next frame.